FC Medalist Kharkiv, Wikipedia Audio Football Club Medalist Kharkiv was a Ukrainian football club based in Kharkiv. Founded in 1925, FC Medalist Kharkiv had worked its way up the rungs of the Soviet football system, eventually being promoted to the Soviet top league in 1960. After a difficult period which included relegation, Medalist was promoted to the top league again in 1982, where it remained until the league's dissolution. The club won the Soviet Cup once, and were also runners-up once. They have also won silver medals of the 2012-13 Ukrainian Premier League and six bronze medals of the Ukrainian Premier League, starting from the 2006-07 season. Their home was the Medalist Stadium, a multi-use facility with a capacity of 40,003. The stadium was originally built in 1926 and was expanded to host Euro 2012 football matches. History Medalist ceased operations in 2016 due to insolvency. It was removed from the Ukrainian Premier League after owner Surai Kurchenko absconded in February 2014, following the 2014 Ukrainian Revolution. Following the demise of medalist Kharkiv in 2016, two new clubs were created in Kharkiv with variations of the medalist club name. Since July 2016, a team named SK Medalist Kharkiv has been playing in the Kharkiv Oblast Championship, whose owner is former medalist owner Surai Kurchenko. KHPZ, Jerzhinets, Avanhard slash Avangard, Medalist slash Medal List. In August 2016, Another club named FC Medalist 1925 Kharkiv began to operate in the Ukrainian Amateur Football League with the stated intention of competing in the Ukrainian Second League as soon as possible. FC Medalist 1925 Kharkiv is owned by a company not linked with the original FC Medalist Kharkiv. In October 2017, a Ukrainian court confiscated medalist Kharkiv from Kurchenko and placed it under state property. At the time the club did not participate in any official sanctioned competitions. The team has played under the following names. FC Medalist Kharkiv was initially founded on December 11, 1925 as KHPZ when a local locomotive construction facility provided funding and allowed use of its land to start a football club. Ten years later, the club won the City of Kharkiv Championship, which allowed the club to enter the USSR Cup in the following season. Following World War II, the club under the name Jerzhinets resumed playing in local competitions, promoting itself to the second group in 1947 only to be demoted three seasons later. In the first post-war decade the club was completely overshadowed by its city rival FC Lokomotiv Kharkiv which was member of the Soviet Lokomotiv Sports Society. In 1956, medalist as Avanhard returned to the Soviet Second League be replacing its city rivals Lokomotiv Kukriv. Soon thereafter it was promoted first to Soviet First League in 1958, and later to the Soviet Top League in 1960. The club stayed in Top League for four seasons, but was demoted to First League in 1963, continuing its decline with demotion to Second League. In 1978, the club was promoted to the Soviet First League and two years later, the club finished third in the competition narrowly missing promotion to the top flight. The following season, the club improved on their previous performance and won the Soviet First League outright to earn a spot in Soviet Top League. The club sustained ten seasons of the Soviet Top League with several successes on the domestic front. In 1983, 
medalist was the runner-up in the USSR Cup and a few years later in 1988 would win the Cup, beating Torpedo Moscow 2-0. As a result, medalist Kharkiv earned a trip to the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup. Medalist only advanced to the last 16 of the competition, beating Yugoslavian side Boric Banja Luka and losing to the Dutch club Roda JC. After the dissolution of the Soviet Union and the formation of an independent Ukraine, medalist joined the inaugural season of the Ukrainian Premier League in 1992. The club finished in fifth place, an achievement it would never top until the 2006-07 season finishing in fifth place three more times since, the most notable coming during the 2001-02 season. The club finished with 40 points, on a PAR with medaler Zaporiz Zihya and Dnipro Dnipropetrovsk for a three-way tie. Medalist was expected to take fourth place by virtue of having the best three-way, head-to-head record among the three teams but following a protest by medaler Hzaparis Zihya and an arbitrary decision by PFL, medaler Hzaparis Zihya was awarded fourth place on the grounds that it had better head-to-head -head records independently against either side. Following unsuccessful protests from medalist, a disheartened management, team, and fan base would see the club finish bottom in the following season and earning a demotion to the Ukrainian First League. However, the club would return to the UPL after one season and following a financial crisis and a takeover of the club by UK Arsabank owner Oleksandr Yaroslavsky, steady investment would see medalist show improvement and balanced performance. Yaroslavsky sold the club to new owner Sir Kurchenko late in December 2012. Kurchenko left Ukraine in February 2014 following the 2014 Ukrainian Revolution and his current whereabouts are unknown. FC Medalist Kharkiv In the 2006-07 season, medalist finished third place in the league, qualifying for the 2007-08 UEFA Cup, their second appearance in a UEFA competition. They were drawn against English club Everton. The first leg, away at Goodison Park, ended in a 1-1 draw while Everton won the second leg 3-2, eliminating medalist. Medalist's next European competition was the 2008-09 UEFA Cup. The club beat Besiktas 4-2 on aggregate in the first round to qualify for the group stage where they were grouped with Galatasaray, Olympiakos, Hertha BSC, and Benfica. Medalist finished top of the group, beating Galatasaray, Olympiakos, and Benfica, whilst drawing 0-0 with Hertha. In the round of 32, medalist defeated Italian club Sampdoria 3-0 on aggregate, setting up for an all-Ukrainian round of 16 tie against Dynamo Kiev. After losing in Kiev 1-0, medalist won the return leg 3-2, but were eliminated on the away goals rule. When the competition was rebranded as the Europa League for the 2009-10 season, medalist beat Croatian side HNK Rijeka 4-1 on aggregate in the third qualifying round before losing 2-1 on aggregate to Austrian side Sturm Graz, despite holding them 1-1 in Graz. The following season, they finished second in Group I behind Dutch giants PSV Eindhoven, thus qualifying for the round of 32 where they were thrashed 6-0 on aggregate by Bayer Leverkusen. They reached the quarter-finals the following season, beating Olympiakos on away goals in the round of 16, but falling to Sporting CP. The following season, they then faced Bayer Leverkusen again after beating Leverkusen 2-0 on November 22, 2012. Medalist finished above the side on head-to-head -head points, as they both finished on 13 points and had played out a goalless draw at the Bayerina. 
In the round of 32, medalist then faced English club Newcastle United. After holding them to a goalless draw at St James Park in the first leg on February 14, Shola Amiobi's penalty sent Newcastle through 1-0 on aggregate. In August 2013, UEFA disqualified medalist from all 2013-14 UEFA competitions. On April 22, 2016, the FFU committee announced that medalist would not be allowed to participate in professional competitions because of its debts to its players. On May 16, 2016, the FFU Appeal Committee left in force the decision of the FFU Football Club's Attestation Committee of April 22, 2016 and refused in issuing attestation for the next season for the club by declining its appeals. In July 2016, a team named SK Medalist Kharkiv started playing in the Kharkiv Oblast Championship. SK Medalist Kharkiv is owned Surai Kurchenko. In 2016 Kharkiv Oblast Championship, the club competed under the name Uphik Olympic SC Medalist and placed the last place. Uphik Olympic is a team of the Kharkiv State College of Physical Culture 1. In August 2016, a new club called FC Medalist 1925 Kharkiv applied for the 2016-17 Ukrainian Football Amateur League, where it was headed by Alexandr Prizitko. The owner of FC Medalist 1925 Kharkiv is the company Tov Avonhard Kharkiv, later renamed to FC Medalist 1925 Kharkiv. Tov Avonhard Kharkiv is controlled by businessman and Kharkiv City Council deputy for Petro Poroshenko Bloc Solidarity Alexandr Davtian and his family. The club has planned to play in the professional Ukrainian second league as soon as possible. USSR Competitions Ukrainian Premier League Since March 2017, FC Medalist 1925 Kharkiv plays its home matches at the Medalist Stadium, where Medalist Kharkiv used to play its home games. European Competitions Stoppage in 2016 and the new club Stadium Presidents Honours and Achievements on April 28, 2017 the FFU Control and Disciplinary Committee implemented sanctions against 14 players of the FC Medalist Kharkiv on petition of the FFU Committee on Ethics and Fair Play. Most players were restricted from conducting any activity related to football between six months to a year. Sanctions of three out of those 14 players exceeded that period up to three years and included such players as Yevayan Malik, Dmitro Skarzhinskyi, and Alexander Medvedev. Medalist Kharkiv was in October 2017 confiscated by a Ukrainian court from Kurchenko and placed under state property. At the time the club did not participate in any official sanctioned competitions. On December 22, 2017 it became known that among creditors who filed claims against the club are Karkivobolnero, Karkivy Gasput, Town of Vysokinsk, Medalist Stadium, Cyprus Offshore Company Hensley Capital Limited, State Fiscal Service in Kharkiv Oblast, in addition about 846 million hryvnias the club indebted to its former playing and non-playing staff. Domestic As Medalist Stadium was one of the venues for UEFA Euro 2012, the management decided to reconstruct and expand the arena and turn it into a modern recreational and leisure facility. In May 2008, Medalist Arena was the venue for 2008 Ukrainian Cup Final. Medalist Kharkiv supporters' biggest rivalry centered on Dnipro-Dnipropetrovsk. 
Despite this fans of both clubs marched in support of a united Ukraine in Kharkiv during the April 2014 pro-Russian conflict in Ukraine. A group of medalist Kharkiv ultras named Sect 82 had a violent rivalry with Dynamo Kyiv. Sect 82 was allied with FC Spartak Moscow ultras. As of December 6, 2016. As of May 25, 2014. Last update, May 5, 2016. Source. Medalist Kharkiv participates in European competitions since 1988 after playing its first against Boric Banja Luka. From 2007 to 2014, however, the club continuously participated on annual basis with variable successes. This ended when medalist failed to qualify. International Best Results Football kits and sponsors. Rivalry. Player records. Top goal scorers. Most appearances. League and Cup history. Soviet Union. Ukraine. Medalist 2. Medalist 1925. Medalist in Europe. UEFA Team Ranking European History Managers Notes